Nice to meet you. Uh, it's been so nice to meet you, Monica. I'm so excited about this project. Uh, I've seen quite a few episodes up till now, and I'm invested. <laughs> yes, thank you for watching. <laughs> so I'm always excited when I see female names in the credits uh, as showrunner and creators because it's not so often you see them, and when you do, it's often accompanied by by a male name. So in your case, you have not one, but two credits just in the opening. One as executive producer and the other as creator. I was I was very, uh, watching very attentively. <laughs> so that is very exciting. So first of all, uh, based on Swanson's book, Manhunt, why this story? Why was it so important to take this story to the screen? Thank you so much. Um, yes, I think that um, it's still rare for women to um, have the opportunity to tell, uh, you know, such an original story, um, such an ambitious, uh, large-scale story. Um, and so I'm so proud to have achieved that. And um, Swanson's book um, is something that's very beloved by many people. His research in it is incredibly detailed. Um, and so it was an honor that he gave me his blessing to use um, it to, you know, have details for a part of the show. I'm sure that as uh, detailed as it is, uh, you not always have like the time or the space to, to tell absolutely everything that's detailed in the book. So how do you make the decisions of what goes on the show and what you have to cut off? I would actually say that the show has much more uh, story in it than the book because um, I'm telling the story of Edwin Stanton, who was the lead investigator to track down Booth and avenge Lincoln's uh, murder. Um, and then also I was able to bring in stories about women um, and other people who were affected by the assassination. So Mary Todd Lincoln and black witnesses in the trial for the of the conspirators. Um, so I was able to really expand the world um, in a way that makes it very layered and um, shows how the assassination affected the most powerful person, the vice president who became the president, all the way down to former slaves. You know that we're currently in award season, right? So I've been binge watching interviews, especially uh, uh, interviews with Greta Gerwig and Margot Robbie. And, and I'm very invested in how they're narrating, you know, the, the extensive work they put in, uh, get, just getting the project off the ground. So in your case, uh, how was it uh, getting this project off the ground? What, what does that process look like? I would say in some ways it took me, you know, 15 years of my career to, um, have someone bet on me to create a show. But at the same time, um, when I brought the idea of doing a cat and mouse uh, detective thriller about the assassination to Apple, the, the executives I pitched to instantly understood the potential of it uh, in the room. Amazing. So thank you so much for your time. It's a great show. So thanks. Thank you so much. Nice okay. to meet you.